This week, I'm going to tell you, I told you so. That's right, it's not often I actually use the terms, I told you so, because they can often come back and bite you on the backside. But this week, I want to say, I told you so. Now, about two two and a half years ago, I did a tutorial on placards and I went to, and you can see it on screen there and we'll run some B-roll over the top. We went to a monument in Germany and there was all of these placards around and it was at a very high vantage point and it was basically telling people how and what was going on around them and you know the villages in the distance and the main roads and the rivers and all those kind of things you get the idea from these vantage points you've all been to one and it tells you imposed on a kind of plate what the surrounding area is now we all get that now of course we have placards on all of our products that we produce as well and this is where my tutorial was coming from because I was talking about how I believed back then how this kind of placard information was going to be enhanced, not changed, but enhanced with things like augmented reality. And back then, even only two, two and a half years ago, there were still lots of people very skeptical about augmented reality. And I believe that placards is an area where augmented reality is really going to be strong. And I used this example by saying, hey, if I had my mobile phone and I pointed it at this horizon, could you imagine how cool it would be if an augmented reality, augmented reality app popped up with all of the little icons that I'd be interested in, in terms of the area that I was looking at? And that would add much more depth and usefulness to the information of the area that I was in. So, you know, when we put something onto a plate or we impose something on a plate, that's it. It's there. That's very one dimensional. It's not going to be enhanced in any way unless we change it. But with augmented reality, we can add extra and further depth to it. So I used the example where I said, look, if I use my phone now and I pointed it out here, how cool would it be if it gave me all of these landmarks and it, if I clicked on it, it told me more information and it took me to areas that are interesting to me. And what's really cool is that somebody's just done it. Now, if you know or you've just done a tutorial that, uh, that we've done recently, we looked at the Ordnance Survey and we looked about how the Ordnance Survey has had to reinvent itself and how it's had to think and embrace social media and technology and apps based on their old traditional paper-based maps and how they are now having to embrace new ways of doing things. Well, augmented reality is something they announced only yesterday. In their app now, you can point at a landscape and up will pop all areas of interest. So it will say, this town is so many miles away, over there, that town's so many miles away, there's a public house here, there's, you know, a hostel here, or whatever. You can now point it at a specific area, and it will give you all of that information on your mobile device. Much, much more enriched than even just looking at a map on their mobile device, and also certainly far more enriched than just having something printed on a map. But I just want to say, I said this two years ago, that somebody will do this, and Ordnance Survey have already started putting a lot of effort into this. So, I just wanted to say, I told you so. <laughs>